Not a word of Bekalam was written in Belize. It was written during the Biafra War in Nigeria. It was written in um, Afghanistan. It was written in parts of the United States and finished in Bangladesh. Dhaka, Bangladesh, in a neighborhood called Gulshan. And my children were small then. And I had read about, I had read Narda Dobson's History of Belize, published by Longman. And so I, I heard that Longman was going to be um, producing um, a new series of Caribbean literature called Drumbeat. So I wrote to them and asked if I could submit some chapters. They said yes, so I submitted some chapters. And then I submitted the novel, completed. And then I, I still have the letter on, in those days it, we used to get airmail letters from abroad on thin blue airmail papers, typed. And this editor had taken the trouble to write a page, more than a page and a half, telling me how wonderful he thought the book was. But unfortunately, it, was, it did not fit their list. So that was my first, uh, yeah, and it was also my first experience of nearly getting the right market, but just missing it. Because I didn't realize that the books that they were going to publish, they were only going to publish the West Indian Islands. They weren't going to include Belize and Guyana. So I missed that market. And I have what I call a know-it-all husband who had told me from the beginning to send it to Heinemann, you know. And um, I belong to a book group, an international book group in uh, International Women's Book Club in Dhaka, Bangladesh, where we just re met to read and talk. So they were all crushed when they heard the book had just missed the market, you know. And um, the next thing I knew, somebody in that group gave me the um, name of the very top man <laughs> in Heinemann, Sir Charles Pick. And she had got the name from somebody who knew somebody who had worked with somebody who had worked <laughs> <laughs> with with Sir Charles Pick. Right. So the, the, the difficulty for my friend is we had to track down the, 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 the name because um, so eventually we had the name of the 10th or 12th somebody who had worked with him. And so I wrote the letter asking if I could submit my chapter. You have to tell them what the book is about. And so it must have been come as quite a shock to him to get a letter from Bangladesh asking if I could submit ch chapters of a book about Belize, right? <laughs> but they ran the Caribbean Writers Series, which is still going today.